Harbro sugar-free gummy bears. If you ever hear someone describe this to you, run the other way. Make sure these things are buried deep underground because the product reviews that are on Amazon are absolutely legendary. This is a reading from one of my live streams of it and it was so funny. I almost couldn't contain myself. I almost couldn't even read through the entire thing. So sit back, relax, grab your popcorn and enjoy this reading. View of the bears first. Oh, I got I uh, the uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh. Okay. Hold on. I got to re I got to re read the review of these bears. Find the review apparently first in 20,000 reviews there desolator. It's a one star. There's 4% of these in a one star. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Found the review for me. Okay. Okay. This is by someone by the name of Luke, so it's a it's a whatever name. Here we go. This is the review. The one star review of Harboro Gummy Bears from Luke. See you in hell, Harboro Sugar-Free Gummy Bears. This is back on June 5th, 2015. In my last class of, of the September, and the final exam was worth 30% of our grade. After a late night session, I felt confident, but I had to decide between sleeping in, a, in or cooking breakfast. My eyelids closed sleep, my eyelids chose sleep, sorry. Uh, my stomach later regretted this decision. And after several uncomfortable stomach growls, I finally decided to make a quick stop at the campus bookstore and grab a, God, I hate these ones, snack before my test. Since the semester was ending and everyone was going home for the summer, a lot of items were for sale, including snacks and candy. Being in the hunger state that I was in, it felt only logical to pick up the latest yet least expensive candy in order to get my bang for my buck. And there they sat, two bags of Harboro sugar-free gummy bears. Buy one, get one free. What a deal, I thought na naively. I would eat one bag before the test, one bag afterwards. As I walked into class, I gleefully chewed on those abominable <laughs> little bastards unaware of the utter mayhem that would soon unleash upon my poor, poor anus. I sat down at the desk as the professor informed us that due to issues with cheating in the past, restroom breaks would be prohibited until the completion of the exam. Negative. <laughs> I'll give you 10 minutes to use the raw restroom now. This will be your last chance, any takers. The demon bears hadn't released their unholy necromancy upon my stomach yet. So in my moment of ignorant foolishness, I remained seated, still munching on those miniature bear-shaped bombs. After the students were wise enough to take the professor's office, the offer had returned, the professor handed out the test. I was six questions in when it happened. It started subtly at first almost like the slight tingly sensation in my lower abdomen, abdomen. I thought nothing of it, assuming my intestines were just doing their thing. Little did I know that my intestines were trying desperately to warn me of the horror that was on the horizon. By question nine, it happened again, but this time it was followed by a sharp pain, as if those infernal hellions had orchestrated an attack upon my colon. I fought to contain the, the groan and that tried escaping my lips. <laughs> it was the point I began to panic. Something was going horribly long. Long? How about wrong? Uh, and I needed to get through this test before it got any worse. Question 14. My worst fear was upon me. The Satan bears burning. Hot, liquidy, dark magic crashed against my anal sphincter like a tidal wave. I was able to choose the latch just in time, but those relentless toxic bears against it, like orcs beating down the doors of Helm's Deep, I knew I wouldn't be able to, to so much as shift in my seat without risking a breach. I 
kept fighting through the exam, clenching my cheeks with all my might. Beads of sweat began rolling down my neck. Suddenly, a loud gurgling war cry came from my belly, and the entire class lifted their heads. At this point, nothing mattered except expelling the odd godly presence from my bowels. With 15 questions left, I promptly wrote C for every answer and ran out of the classroom. My professor yelled something, but I too was preoccupied with a volcanic eruption that needed to take place before I could find my sweet, sweet relief. Richard, is there something you want to say? You look like you want to get something out, son. Oh my god! I burst into the restroom like the Kool-Aid man. Popple! Oh no! Oh no! Ah! Oh yeah! And behold, the handicapped stall was empty. Sun rays from the adjacent window shone above it and upon it, as if by, it was a gift from God himself. It took me less than 0.5 seconds to undo my belt buckle pulled out my pants, and finally relaxed my weary buttocks upon the toilet seat. It took absolutely no effort to expel the demon. Almost immediately, the floodgates of hell were opened, and the damn liquid-fight souls of the entire bag's worth of gummy bears cried as they burned through my sphincter and into the watery abyss below. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, this poor guy. I have never felt such stimulus relief in my, and anguish in my life. After 30 more minutes of this, I immediately went home, dug a hole in my backyard, and burned the remaining bag of gunny bears. I leave with this. Do not, I repeat, do not eat these spawns of Satan. Not only did they cause me to fail my final test, but the anguish I experienced is something I wouldn't wish upon anyone. Not even my worst enemy. The only place these godforsaken hell bears belong are buried deep below the earth's surface. Dude. When you bury them beneath the earth, they will come back. Those don't degrade. They, they, they will come back and they will bubble up out of the ground and they will, they will just start multiplying. You don't know what you've done here, man. He doesn't know what he's done. Well, I know not everyone catches the live stream, so I had to share this out there on its own video. It's absolutely epic, this tale of the gummy bear. It's one of those one of those things and if you want me to continue covering random stories like this link them down not link them but let me know where to find them down below in the comment section anyway i'm your proud king phoenix sinner shadow i'm signing off here thanks for watching everyone have yourselves a great day <laughs>